Hi guys, it's Sam and I am going to be doing another declutter video and this time it's going to be pants. And in my last declutter video, uh, which was shirts, I didn't realize that when I filmed the other way, usually I film the selfie way on my phone, when I film the other way that the mic would be so much louder. So I'm going to try to be more mindful of that. And let me just show you the drawer where my pants are. Okay, so this is my dresser, which I I didn't show before. Um, I mean, I did, and I've talked about it. This is the Hemnes drawer uh, from Ikea, and it's fantastic. There's a lot of drawer space, and you can tell that there's different sizes, and it just is a wonderful piece of furniture. I highly recommend it. They have different colors. I believe they have gray. Uh possibly black um i'm not sure if they have other colors but this one i just love the color and this is a really great drawer so uh again filled up to the top and there's pants leggings and shorts in here and i kind of want to obviously i want to fix this up so i'm gonna take everything out and let's go from there just wanted to give you a little overview of all the bottoms that I own. So these are my slacks slash work pants. Uh, these are all of my colored jeans and some of these include jeggings that are colored. Uh, here are my leggings that are mostly black and then those are my shorts and then here are my blue jeans slash blue jeggings. Okay guys, so I just wanted to come on here before I started sorting and just tell you a little bit about my career without getting into detail. I used to work in an office and in that office it was uh, business casual, leaning on the casual side. You were able to wear jeans and t-shirts um, just as long as you didn't look like a slob. Uh, and so a lot of my wardrobe was based on that because I used to work in that office for a very long time. Uh, now I am switching careers and I uh, this is the career I'm probably going to be in for the rest of my life uh, until I retire and this is also business casual so um, I just wanted to mention that quickly your war your your career let me get my words together oh <laughs> your career kind of dictates dictates part of your wardrobe and um, I'm very lucky to be in a career where really what I wear every day could be uh, what I could wear to work so uh, I'm not sure why I had to tell you that but I feel like it kind of plays into uh, what I'm keeping and what I'm tossing I have that in my mind so let's get started the first thing I'm going to sort through are jeans I first want to say please excuse the dog hair I it's vacuum day and I haven't vacuumed yet uh, poor planning but this is this is the pile um, if I don't wear in two months like usual I will be donating them they're American Eagle jeans these are probably my only kind of boot cut jeans so I should keep them just to have a pair uh, but I really only wear skinny jeans and I like skinny jeans uh, because I can wear boots with them and I love wearing boots in the fall and the winter and it's just much easier to get boots over skinny jeans than obviously boot cut jeans so uh, that's the pair that I'm probably gonna donate then here are my blue jeans and I really like dark blue skinny jeans and these are mostly from style and co you'll find a lot of my pants are actually from style and co they're just a fantastic uh, brand I just love that they have uh, different colored jeans they have different styles and colors to choose from so uh, and they're inexpensive so that's why I like them and you know I'll wear these until they become just worn out so I like to have more than one pair of uh, the same type of jean just because um, if I wear them out then I'll have another one and they'll take a while longer to wear out uh, yeah so this is um, that's what I'm gonna be keeping and do you think I should maybe get like a different color I don't know in the future I'll keep that in mind so this is what's happening with the jeans so these are the shorts and I decided this is the one, these are the ones that I am going to be keeping and these are the ones that I will be donating and honestly I haven't worn any of these in here in years and um, I don't wear shorts that often. Um, you would think in the summer I would wear shorts but I really don't. I'm just most comfortable in pants and oh 
Hello. Come on. Go in there. Would you like to help out? Come here. Go. She doesn't know where to go. Oh, yes. Okay, Ava. Go. Go up there. Go. What are you doing? Oh, my goodness. Go. 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 Oh, <laughs> she doesn't know where to go. Okay. So, yeah, I don't wear a lot of shorts in the summertime. And these are the ones that are my favorite. I've had this one for a really long time. But I still think it looks cute. And I will be keeping this pile. Okay, so here are my leggings, and I used to have so many more leggings than this. It's kind of embarrassing. Uh, leggings were all the rage a few years back, and that's all I wore almost every day. And so um, I decided that I don't need that many leggings. I haven't worn leggings in a while. Um, although, I used to, you know, that fall is coming around the corner. Sorry for people who love summer, but um, fall's around the corner, and... Uh, I used to wear a lot of leggings in the fall with boots as well so um, I decided to keep these three uh, but I will be getting rid of these because I just you know this is just way too many leggings to have and I don't wear them that much anymore so that's the leggings here are my colorful jeans and to the disappointment of some of you this is a pile that I will be donating. I, at one point, did wear uh, colorful jeans. It was fun, and um, that is no longer, unfortunately, the case. I just don't reach for these um, at all. And, like, let's just say these green and will look like red, but they're more like a wine colored. Uh, I would wear those, like, let's say around Christmas time, and... I just don't do that anymore so I will be donating those this is the pile that I will be keeping and um, even these mint green pants which I love they're I really like it more on my nails than on my uh, legs but I will be keeping those just um, they're really nice I just I have to remind myself to wear them so these are the pants that uh, the colorful jeans that I'll be keeping and lastly here are my dress pants and I will be keeping all of them and here's actually one more uh, so I just feel like since they're all different colors, well, except for the blue, um, I have worn all these from time to time throughout the year and it's just good to have in case I have an occasion, let's say an interview or, um, unfortunately in some cases a funeral or, uh, just an event where I don't feel like wearing a dress. I want to have a nice pair of pants and I have a few colors to choose from. So here's black, blue, and blue here. Um, these are, um like a taupey color with some stripes and then a khaki color so i will be keeping all of these but i think it's uh for good reason and uh yeah that's we're done just to give you an overview of the what's being kept which is this side right here um it's big uh but i feel like this donate pile which is on this side is pretty good as well so uh not too bad this round Okay, and now for the reveal. Uh, so, <laughs> it looks so dark in there. Um, I decided to fold my jeans this way because there was tons of room left in here. And uh, this might change. I don't really love it this way, but I don't love it the other way either. Uh, so, these are my blue jeans here. And then here are my black jeans. And then my colored jeans are underneath. Um, yeah, I might do it another way because I can't really see... You know, and that's a problem. If you don't see your clothes, you're not going to probably wear You're not going to probably wear them. So, um, I might do that roll method, but this is what I have now. And then here, I decided to put my slacks in here. Um, and then underneath are, you know, my leggings and my shorts. I figured that that was just the best way because, um, I don't really wear shorts or leggings, um, that much. Uh, so that is the drawer. And you know what? I'm gonna fix that right now. Let me let me fix it the way I want to see it. And now for the reveal. Ta-da! I de I decided not to go for the roll method. Uh, just it wasn't working out. So here are my black jeans in the back, my blue jeans here, my uh, colored pant jeans, uh, and then here are my leggings and my shorts. And there's still plenty of room in here. Uh, not enough to fit like these are kind of laid on top of each other so I think what I'm gonna do here is put I have a lint brush and that mark there 
is from an eyeliner that won't come off. Uh, but this is just going to wear my lip brush and a few other clothing products uh, will go in there. I know that sounds so weird, right? Clothing products. I just mean like a bleach brush and other things. And then my slacks will go into the closet. And what a life she has, doesn't she? Ava. Say hi to everybody. <laughs> Okay, so we are at the end of decluttering my bottoms, and I just wanted to talk about a couple of things. The first is when you put your clothes away. I feel like if you don't put your clothes back in a nice way or an organized way, you're just asking for trouble. I am notorious for just you know um going through my clothes trying to find something to wear and leaving it a mess that area and I always I'll do that you know for a while and then I'll go look into my drawer and I can't find a thing because I've left it a mess and it's just I you I have to make an effort not to do that uh, just you know when I'm looking for something look for it in a nice way give myself time I'm always in a rush I'll give myself time and then put things away nicely um, it just I guess I have to try to nip that problem in the bud because I'm always doing that always in a rush throwing things around and then when I go back to look for something it's I can't find it because my drawers are a mess so I'm gonna consciously make an effort to put things away nicely and maybe I'll be able to find stuff and wear things that I haven't worn in a while and the other thing was about a seasonal wardrobe I don't follow that um you know how people leave their sweaters and uh, coats downstairs for the winter I the only thing that I have that's not in my room are my coats. Uh, they're downstairs. And I just, I don't know if it's like because I can't part with these things. Uh, but I like to have, all my clothes are in my room. They're somewhere in my room. Um, I even have bathing suits in here, which makes sense for the summertime. But even in the winter, I'll have them here. And um, maybe in the future, if I get a bigger place, I will utilize a seasonal, um, wardrobe, but I actually, I'll wear my clothes, the same clothes all year round. Like, I'll wear jeans all year round. They don't, I don't stop wearing jeans in the summer just because it's hot. If anything, I, like, I, I'll, I'll wear jeans probably 360 days out of the year. Um... So seasonal wardrobe just doesn't work for me. I I don't know. It's just I'm just trying to think why am I like that? But I just I think it stems from when I was younger maybe. I just didn't like you know, I didn't have a lot of things when I was really young. So when I started getting like clothes and things, I just wanted to keep everything with me and that includes books and I've done better with books. Those are the only books I have right up there. Um uh, I used to have like a bookshelf and everything and I think that's I probably would still have the books in my room but I don't have any room so I hope that makes a little bit of sense I just don't do seasonal wardrobes at the moment and I probably should utilize that um, I just don't so I'm just trying to work with what I have and yeah um, this round of pants was pretty good I have to say I'm not trying to pat myself on the back but I think I did pretty well and it's really hard for me I'm staring at the pants right now to let go of all those pants but I'm gonna do it it's got to be done and uh, yeah I hope you guys are all doing well and enjoying my declutter series if you want to suggest anything you want to see me go through uh, that's not makeup related let me know in the comments below uh, yeah I will talk to you guys soon bye